Good day, I'm Adelaide Peters from the Department of Medical Microbiology. This will be a training session on how to collect, collect a urinary tract sample, a midstream urine sample. This form, forms part of a practical application session of MEY. A midstream urine specimen or a clean catch specimen is a method of collecting urine that prevents contamination with either vaginal or penile flora. The test is performed under non-sterile circumstances. What you will need during the collection of this specimen is some soapy water. We will also use some gauze and then also dry soaps to clean afterwards. A waste bucket to discard of any waste. A sterile specimen container and sterile gloves. It is important to be able to explain to your patient how a midstream urine sample must be collected. I will now demonstrate this to you. If possible, always collect the sample after the urine has been in the bladder for two to three hours. You will use the gauze with the soapy water to clean the vulva and the labia of the vagina. Use two fingers to spread the labia. Use the first to clean the inner fold. Then use clean gauze to dry the areas, starting with the inner folds of the labia and lastly around the urethra from where the urine will be. Keeping the labia spread with two fingers, urinate a small amount into the toilet bowl, then with the collection cup a few inches from the urethra, urinate until the cup is halfway full. Take the cup away and empty the bladder into the toilet bowl. Close the specimen container. It is very important to always label the specimen container and to submit this to the laboratory as soon as possible. If it is not possible to submit to the laboratory within a few hours from collection, it is acceptable to refrigerate the urine until transport can be arranged. Always make sure to include the identification of the patient as well as any clinical information that could help with the diagnosis of the patient. Also include whether the patient is on antibiotics or